Hey everyone, um, good morning. Welcome to another video of IELTS. Uh, this is me, Jake Paul. And in today's video, we're going to look at five types of essays that you can get in IELTS Task 2. Now, you might get these five types of essays and there might be also slight variations of these. Um, however, the basic structure remains the same. Okay, so in the first type of essay question that you get is the opinion question. And this is where they ask you to uh, either say, what is your opinion? Um, do you agree or disagree? And for example, you can say, to what extent do you agree or disagree? So you can say, how much do you agree on or how much do you disagree? Um, you can also say you partly agree and partly disagree, and that's okay. But make sure when you say that, you justify your opinion. Um, I've got an example question here for you. Uh, for example, local people should not pay more than foreign visitors for cultural and historical attractions. To what extent do you agree or disagree? So you can either write as all agree, and or you could write it as all disagree, or maybe a bit of both. Um, here's a small tip for me. I'd prefer to say, I, I like to keep it black and white and just say, you know, I fully agree or I fully disagree here. It's so much more easier when you write an essay and when you only have 40 minutes to do it. So think about that. The next type of question is the advantages and disadvantages question. So here they might give you the question, for example, like this, and then they say, discuss the advantages and pardon me discuss the advantages and disadvantages um, or they might say discuss the advantages and disadvantages and give your own opinion so there are three things that you need to talk about here um, for example the internet has had a huge impact on professional and social communication but this impact has been negative as well as positive do the advantages of using email outweigh the advantages so they're asking if there's more disadvantages or more advantages so you've got to mention that clearly in your conclusion when you talk about that um, there's another way of talking about advantages and disadvantages is just to use another word for it and they either say positive or negative development so positive or negative development also means the same thing as an advantages or disadvantages kind of question okay let's look at the third type of essay question it's the problem and solution so basically the question gives you a problem and asks you what are the causes of this problem and then the next part of that question is to solve it so to give them some sort of solutions that's what it is so here in cities and towns all over the world the high volume of traffic is a problem what are the causes of this and what actions can be taken to solve this problem so this two things that you need to talk about but bear in mind it says causes so you need to write more than one cause so i would just say write two and then again what actions it's a plural so again you want to write more than one action so i'd give two actions or two ideas so you got you need to have four ideas in total two for causes and two for actions so make sure that you read the question carefully and here's the next step that's actually connected to all of this is most students in my class um, and I've met don't read the question carefully before they start writing the that essay. Um, they have a quick look at it and I'm not saying they don't look at it altogether. They look at it but not in detail. Not to sort of look at it and stop and think, oh, what are they really asking me to do here? Um, so, you know, even if it's a minute or two just take some time absorb that question different people work differently so you know when you read that question make a small plan think about what you need to do before you start writing that essay okay let's look at the fourth type of essay in IELTS task 2 is the discussion one um, so here they give you a question and they ask you to discuss both views so maybe positive or negative. Uh, and in this case, it says some people believe that working for someone is better. So that's one view. Uh, the second view is others think that working for oneself or themselves is the best way to be employed. 
you need to talk about what the, this view, the first one, the second one, and then give your own opinion to that. So there's three things that you need to talk about here. And finally, the fifth type of essay in IELTS Task 2 is the two-part question. Um, so you have the question here, the way many people interact with each other has changed because of technology, okay? Um, in what ways has technology affected the types of relationships that people make? So that's your first part. Um, and the second part is, has this been a positive or negative development? So this the second part and that's it so you have five types of essays that you can write in IELTS tasks too um, hope this video was useful um, hit like if you found it um, useful in any way and please consider subscribing to the channel thank you so much for watching and bye for now